Hey everybody, just want to do a little video here. It's a long time coming. I uh, I had this brainwave back in July that I would go and find myself a mass transit uh, vehicle to get us back and forth to football games, make sure it had enough seat belts uh, to get us back and forth to football games legally, you know what I'm saying? And uh, anyway, so as you can see, I managed to uh, pick myself up. Oh, sorry for the bad camera work. A 1996 uh, Ford Club Wagon. Chateau edition. Anyways, it's uh, seats seven people uh, legally and so forth. So I'll uh, just go uh, around uh, on it for you so you can kind of soak it all in and uh, see how special this baby is. So starting at the front, you can see we got pretty classic automobile here. Yep, it's a 1996 club wagon. She's sweet. It's got very little weight reduction. I see there's some weight reduction right there. You know what I mean? You gotta, you know, you don't want to haul that much weight around, especially you know, put a bunch of people in there. It's, it's too heavy. You need to uh, keep the weight down. Anyways, very little weight reduction on there. Uh, tires are brand new. Uh, came with them brand new, and uh, the brakes were apparently redone as well. I gotta I think I'm gonna have to maybe bleed those brakes there. That pedal's a little soft, but anyhow. Uh, but yeah, Chateau Club Wagon Chateau Edition. Oh my! Uh, yeah, we got a little bit of trouble there. But sorry for the bad camera work again, but I'm not a professional at this. This is just for fun. So anyway, but uh, as you can see, for 1996, she's not in bad shape at all. Not in bad shape at all. I'm gonna go around the other side and open up the big door, show you what she's like on the inside. Oh, yeah, the windshield was a disaster. I had to replace that. Got that done last week or so, and. Uh, that way uh, we can get stopped by the policeman. Anyways, let's see if we can open this thing up. Get you in on the uh, the fabulous interior. It's unbelievable. Look at that headliner. It's like not a tear, hardly even a stain. It's all good. You know what I mean? It's uh, it's in pretty darn nice shape. Seats are all good. <laughs> Came with enough floor mats, but you can carpet your hose with it. Anyway. As you can see, lots of formats. But yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's awesome. I was just looking over there. I know the uh, sun is kind of shining in the wrong spot, but if you zoom in on that, look at the stereo controls and everything. Yep. Radio doesn't even work. So anyway, that's enough. We'll just ignore that. Bluetooth, you know, get a Bluetooth speaker. She'll be all good. Anyway, but amazing. The features. How nice it is. I think I done good. I think I done good. Anyhow, I want to do a little test to uh, to see. I, uh, this thing has hardly gone on any gone any distance at all. Uh, on the, at a time, you know, just little trips here, maybe 20, 25 kilometers at a time since I've got it. And, you know, I don't really trust it 100% yet. So today we're going to do a little test on her and uh, we'll see what happens. But uh, anyway, hopefully uh, we don't run into any trouble. And Stay tuned. I'll, uh, I'll talk to you about that test here right okay, away. So, yeah, like I say, we're going to run this baby through a test today. And uh, anyway, uh, it's been through a few trips back and forth to to the city, you know, 20, 30 kilometer trips at a time, but nothing major. So I thought uh, we better run it through a nice little test to see if it actually will stand up. This is a, a little bit of uh, more mileage at once. And uh, just to add a little weight to her to put a little test on her, we're going to throw on a trailer with some bales in it. And we're going to go about 220 kilometers uh, round trip. And we'll see how the old club wagon chateau handles it. All right, we're underway and normal temperature, oil pressure is normal, going 110. A few lights on the dash. It's okay to have a Christmas tree when it's in 1996. Carry on.
Well, this concludes uh, the test for the 96 Club Wagon Chateau edition there. Uh, anyway, uh, the test was very successful. Uh, ran great the entire time. Um, and, uh, you know, the transmission was great. Uh, engine ran nice and smooth. And uh, you know what? It, it pulled that trailer pretty well. Um, a little bit rougher because the trailer bouncing back there a bit. But you know what? Uh, I did a, a fuel mileage test on it. Pretty surprised. 19 liters per 100 kilometers with that trailer on behind. So you know what? I think that uh, if we uh, do a fuel mileage test uh, uh, without that trailer, I think it should probably be around the 15, uh, maybe 14 liters per 100 kilometers. Uh, you know, and I think in today's day and age with uh, 1996, you're probably doing pretty good. Oh, uh, just before I go, uh, one thing. I know Frank would be a little ticked off if I don't mention that you should hit that like button and go ahead and smack that subscribe button as well. I uh, always like to have a few new subscribers uh, just putting on some fun stuff. And anyhow, uh, talk to you all again soon.